And with the Memorial Day weekend upon us, it is time to start thinking about those summer travel plans. Our Sonia Ellison joins us now with some of the ideas that people in the southern tier have for their summer. Memorial Day weekend is here as well as the unofficial start to summer 2024. Right now, summer travel is on the minds of many. Going to the beach. The rise in travelers for the holiday weekend led to a temporary spike in gas prices, but that's not stopping the travel season from starting. Jersey or Boston or some nice beach far away from AAA says almost 44 million people across the country will be traveling 50 or more miles away from home for the holiday weekend, a 4% increase from last year, starting the summer travel season strong. Just like the traffic on I-86 today, the Kenona rest stop was packed with travelers. Well, we're from England. Julie and Joe are one of the over 3.5 million vacationers that traveled by plane this year, a number that's up almost 5% from last year. We came into New York City you know, over a week ago, then we flew to North Carolina, and now we're on a road trip on our way up to Perry, New York, where we've been stopping along the way. Their travel advice? Best Western we've been staying at has been the best place to stay. 63% of people in the U.S. plan on staying at hotels this summer. But though travel costs are up from last summer, some hotel markets are seeing record-breaking average daily rates. Hotel chains like Best Western have seen this uptick in the past few years as the economy rebounds from the pandemic. Everywhere we stop, everyone's been really friendly. No matter how far or near you'll be for the season. I own the glass menagerie. It's where I'll be all summer. Summer 2024 is already shaping up to be a very busy one for travel. Sonia Ellison, Big Fox News, The Southern Tier.